welcome back for another video so I am back just to chit chat some hair chit chat with you guys I know it's been a while um, and I do have a few things to update you guys on um, so yeah this is my hair as you can see I just took it out of a bun I had to straighten my hair for the clip-ins if you have not seen that video I'm going to leave an eye card right here and I'm also going to leave it in the description box but I just had clip-ins in so I needed to straighten my hair so that's why my hair is straight and I figure why not um, go ahead and do a hair update for you guys. So um, I am a little under two years post relaxer, well into my transition because I am transitioning to natural. So I'm two years, I will make two years in what April the, I want to say the 19th, I want to say April the 19th will make two years. I have um, done a, quite a few things to my hair. Um, as you guys know, I well, if you know, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I did do a cut in when was that December? So if I can find the footage, I'm going to be playing that right along here while I'm speaking. Let me scoot over so it'll have room to play. So um, I did cut about three inches off my hair um, in December and. Um, I, I really love the way my ends look. When I was cutting my hair, I didn't realize it was that much. Well, I did, but I didn't because it was kind of just like my straight ends. So they were super thin, as you guys can probably see on this video plan. They were super thin, and it was just easier for me to cut it while it was straight rather than being in its wash state and wet. I really like to cut mine while it's straight because of how I like my ends to be or how I'm looking forward to my ends of being, okay? <laughs> So, so, excuse me if you hear my daughter. So, if you see on the video, I did cut about three inches. And this is my hair. And once I cut those three inches, it seems like my hair just got, like, super thick instantly. I'm actually, um, I'm absolutely loving the thickness of my hair. And just the way it looks, I, I really, really do like it. It was just so much hair. And I did not, I already didn't have a, a lot to cut once I hit my two year mark because I was just going to cut all my relaxed ends off at my two year mark but once I saw it it was it was like I don't know I, I feel like I have a few like seriously like a few areas in my hair where I have to cut off maybe a half an inch and I will be 100% natural so seeing my hair in a straightened state and seeing this length knowing that seriously I, I know I'm about 90% natural um, versus the text last ends that I have to cut off. Just seeing my hair like this makes me really happy and make me happy with the decision of my transitioning because my hair is thick from roots all the way down excluding some areas where I have to cut off my text life in. So as you, most of you know I do have a daughter. I had my daughter 10 months ago and I did not experience any shedding seriously. No excessive shedding or anything like that for the first until recently. And she's should be 10 months tomorrow so until recently I had not been experiencing any shedding now all of a sudden the shedding is just like out of nowhere like smacking me around smacking my hair around with this shedding so I kind of just wanted to show you guys um, where the shedding is going on right around here and my hair is already um, my hair is already um, oh, what am I trying to say okay so let me see to it all back so my hair naturally goes back like this you see where I'm pointing it naturally goes back like this so that's not what I'm talking about this is what I'm talking about can you see that I hope you guys can see this is all shedding now I'm not talking about this spot right here because that's always been there that's just how my hair grow, grows I'm just talking about this part right here you see that and also on this side which is a common a common area um, to shed and all of that stuff um, after you have the baby so that's where my shedding is coming so um, not my shedding that's where my breakage has and my shedding is just coming period so now I'm at a point where I'm going to braid my hair up and go in between my um, lace fronts and those clip-ins that I had in I might do a video on how I install them 
uh, with no leave out other than this part right here. So the rest of my hair will be braided. But that's a whole nother video. So yeah, I just wanted to come and give you guys an update on my hair. Like it's really bouncy and flowy. And um, yeah, I want to show you guys the side if I can. Okay, so this is kind of like the back. Um, I'm not focused on length, so I have no idea where it is. I'll just focus on the way it looks uh, and feels. So, um, I think what I'm going to do is the next time I wash my hair, I'm going to come and show you guys my hair. And I am just going to clip uh, whatever relax is are left on my hair. Okay, so that was it, you guys. I just really wanted to come and give you guys an update and show you guys what's going on with my hair. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them down below. And I will see you in my next one. Bye. We are back with Sweet Pea's 8 and 9 month update. She will be she will be 10 months on the 18th of this month. So I'm just going to be going over some of the things 